Hey guys, welcome to this very quick video. I'm just going to be talking about this new page that I found on aistudio.google.com slash apps. And it says here, build your ideas with Gemini. What this effectively is, and this is super, super interesting, super cool, and I think people have a lot to learn from this, mainly because Google is one of the best AI studios for multimodal AI applications. So you can actually see, you can choose all of these different things, right? So let's say we wanted to make an app that did all of these things at once, right? We could say, make me an app with all of these integrations. Now, I'm not gonna necessarily do this. I'm just saying it's super interesting because for example, use Google search data, connect your app to real-time Google search results, build an agent that can discuss current events, cite recent news or fact check information. So what I'm going to do is I'm just going to click use Google search data. I'm going to say, make me a, an app to find video ideas for my channel income stream surfers on latest things that happen in my niche. You will have to understand my YouTube channel to proceed. I mean, this is super interesting. This is popping up with ideas here. So I'm going to say set a real time monitoring of social media news outlets. So I'll just say add to chat. Sure. Okay. So it doesn't actually do it instantly, but whatever. So you could, you could just keep pressing like, yeah, I want that. I want this. I want the other, et cetera, et cetera. And it will slowly, but actually pretty quickly start to build what you want. Just so you know, guys, there is a link in the description of this video to sign up to a free dev discovery call. If you have an MVP or just a project that you want to work on, or even something that you want automating for a business that you work for or your own business or anything, contact us today. We're looking for new projects to work with AI scraping, AI SaaS tools, just basically AI building anything. It doesn't have to be AI in the app as well. Just if you want something built for slightly cheaper and maybe more effectively than other companies, check out the link in the description. And there's a basically a link to a discovery call with me and my business partner, Rowan. Okay, so I mean, 23 seconds in, uh, we have something here. So um, find me some ideas. Uh, my channel is income stream surfers. Find viral ideas. So the really cool thing about this is there shouldn't be any mistakes in this. Yes, it's a very simple system, but it's also a very quick, easy way to build something that you could potentially sell, MVP, see if people are interested, see what, see how it works even, right? You can just look, you can click on code here and you can say, okay, so now I know how to make a call to Gemini, right? So we have Gemini service here and you can actually see the prompt and you could change the prompt if you wanted as well. Okay, so let's just quickly look through these ideas. So AI side hustles that actually pay. So you can see that's actually understood my channel. This is a video that would potentially do quite well on my channel. So it's not just bullshit, fake, oh, you know, it's not actually connected to the internet, et cetera, et cetera. You can see it is genuinely connected to the internet. What else do we have? So gig economy 2.0, how to professionalize your side hustle and earn more. Digital gold rush 25, top digital products to sell passive income now. So we've got all these different ideas. Let's just actually double, triple check that it is um, actually connected to the internet. Just because you could refer from the name of the channel, Income Stream Surfers, a lot of things, right? Oh, okay, no, sorry, it is right. So you can see here, Tools Google Search, so it does have access to the internet simply by adding this here. So what does this teach us, guys? You don't have to just go with what this is showing you and say, okay, so how do we build my tool inside this, right? What we can do instead is we can take what it's given us here and act as if it were an MVP, right? So I'm sure you can download this code, right? Download the application. You can now take this to Claude code and start to work around it, start to create an actual business around it. Th this is a five minute MVP, right? Now, what would be really cool is if they added payment. If they add payment here, this will make Google one of the best places to make an MVP because you saw how quick that was for me to make a basic React application with AI inside it. Imagine if we could do that with payments, that would be cool. And also database. These are the kind of things that Google, in my opinion, should be doing. They just don't seem to be bothered about them. So let's see if I say, and we add a database to store people's requests. I'm just curious to see how it would deal with a quote like, uh, with a prompt like that, right? It probably can't deal with it. I wouldn't be surprised if it just says I can't do 
that. Yeah, however, the current front end only, whatever. Okay. So this, I will tell you right now, guys, this is pretty much useless to people, but except for a very, very good use case, which is to create a very fast MVP, which you can then take and then use to create something a little bit more in detail. The other use case, which in my opinion is arguably even more important, is just so people can grab or just understand things like, oh, you can, you know, use AI with 50 lines of code, right? This is prompted for me, so you can take away all these prompts as well, and literally, it's created the system, and you can see what it does here, right? Now, this isn't JSON, but you could view this as JSON, right? It's almost JSON. It's not JSON, but it, it, it it's pretty much, if you know how JSON works, these are pretty much JSON objects, right? Um, they're not, but just for the sake of argument, they are. What I've been finding recently is AI is incredibly good at coding AI. So if you wanted to, for example, create something that was a little bit more complicated, you could create it here, right? Download it. And remember, we've got video, Google Maps data, search data, you know, Nano Banana app, prompt-based video generation, Gemini Intelligence your app. Most of these things for like 90% of the population it's still just mind blowing, like, oh my God, there's an app on your phone that you can create videos with. Like people aren't up to speed as much as you think they are. In my opinion, right now, there is a hole in the market for just building quick applications and just putting them for free with ads or whatever in the app store or online or whatever, and just seeing how they do and just making more and more and more. You can even generate speech, right? So if you wanted to, you could so quickly and easily make something that would actually genuinely help people and then you could sell and you can start by making the MVP in five minutes using the Google AI Studio. Now, it's been a while since I talked about Google. To be honest with you, I don't talk that much about Google, but the fact that you can come here in five minutes, make an MVP, this is probably where I will start a lot of my processes now. And the cool thing is, it's getting to the point with Google where their models kind of just have everything, right? So I'm not exactly how it would sh sure how it would work with generate speech, but I'm just going to say like, make me a an app that takes transcriptions and makes them into voices, right? I just want to see for me how this works because if it's just the same model, so um, Nano Banana with the same core. It's extremely easy to make an entire application that does thousands of different things with just a very, very small amount of code because you know the way that it produces text is the same the way that it produces um, voice, for example. So again, the same thing. You can see how simple and easy this is. This is like a two minute MVP that you could literally put online with a few changes, add payment and see if people are interested. It, the the times of like spending months and months and months making something, they're just gone, right? In terms of an MVP. I'm not saying you can make a full working production level app in two minutes, obviously. Okay, so you can see here, Gemini 2.5 Flash Preview TTS. Okay, so there is a slightly different call, but it's pretty much the same as all of the other calls, right? Again, extremely simple React app. Took less than three minutes to build. You can now download this, put this into Claude code, put this into whatever you code with and start to make it into a full project Add a back end if you need to, or just do everything in the front end. And yeah, things are starting to get very, very interesting and very exciting in terms of how quick and easy it is to make an MVP. I'll leave the video there, guys. I'm pretty tired from last night. So I just thought I'd make this quickly because I saw this on Julian's channel and I really, really thought it was insane that you can just make an entire app in under a minute mvp app obviously but still take what you've done here put it into claude code mix things up maybe use sub agents to create something really really good and probably within one two hundred thousand context window you're gonna have a production ready app thank you for watching guys if you're watching all the way to the end of the video you're an absolute legend and i'll see you very very soon with some more content peace out